hello guys welcome to how to fix stack in this video guys let me show you the error first this is the error i am not able to open my google chrome the application has failed to start because the side by side configuration is incorrect so if you are facing the same issue this video is for you i will show you how to troubleshoot this issue so click on ok now first step we need to rename the google chrome so right click on the google chrome and go to properties and open the file location here okay now you need to right click on the google chrome like this whatever your option you are getting google chrome exe or the google chrome only just rename it and name it something new like chrome new and hit enter okay once you hit enter click on the new name right click on it and send it to the desktop here create a desktop shortcut let me close this and let me cancel this option as well now you will see two google chrome here now this is a new one okay so you need to double click on the new one if it works then fine but in my case it is not going to resolve the issue so it doesn't fix my issue click on ok button and now if this option is working like the new newly created shortcut is working you can simply delete the older one okay just delete it don't worry your data is no lost and your issue should fix with the first step if still not fix something went wrong with the google chrome so we need to go to control panel to uninstall it go to control panel open it and go to large icons the category should be looking like this go to category large icons then click on programs and feature options here and then look for google chrome one another thing you can do is you can also look for repair to microsoft visual c++ but this will not fix the issue if the particular issue with the google chrome but you can also try this click on change and click on repair once repair restart your system but it will fix your issue if the issue is not with the google chrome but if the issue with the google chrome you need to particularly uninstall the google chrome simply uninstall it click on yes when the prompt opens and it's spinning now let's wait now the google chrome is gone you, you can see there is no option to prompt yes or delete the data if you are getting the option you can delete your data from the google chrome now we need to reinstall the google from from the microsoft edge okay so or the other browser if you have firefox and other browser so go to search bar type for microsoft edge this option open it up and on the search bar you need to type here download google chrome and hit enter i will also give you the link of the google chrome and go to this option which is download open it up and let me open it let's wait for some time click on download google chrome and click on download chrome manually and let's wait for the google chrome to download now you can see the exe file is downloaded here now let me go to download button options here file explorer download google chrome this is a newer one double click on it and simply run it let me cut this option and it should fix your issue this is the last step you can perform click on open when the prompt opens inside here now google chrome is installing so it will take around 2 minutes to reinstall it 
so i am pausing the video for some time then i will show you once the reinstallation is done now it's installing now you can see the google chrome has been installed this is the older one let me cut this okay so now you can see the google chrome has been restored now and all the bookmarks here you can see okay so you can also untick that option which is delete your history or the data okay so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix that